With QuickBooks Online, you and your team can send invoices to customers at any time. Sometimes you want a little more control over when invoices are sent, especially when they're for larger amounts or sent to special customers. In QuickBooks Online Advanced, you can set up an invoice approval workflow so your team can create invoices and all your leads need to do is approve and send them off. Let's go over how to set up invoice approvals and what it looks like when an invoice needs to be approved. Select Workflows. Under this tab, you see different templates. Select Invoice Approval Template. Let's set up a workflow that makes invoice over $500 require approval. Give the Invoice Approval Workflow a name. Since you have more than one workflow in QuickBooks at a time, it's important that you can tell them apart. When you create a workflow, you choose what you want QuickBooks to do. Select Send for Approval from the drop-down menu. Now you can tell QuickBooks how to trigger this action. By selecting the Create an Approval task in Tasks, you can assign this workflow to either an admin or any user of your choice. You may change the task name if you wish to. QuickBooks creates a task and notifies whoever you have picked when an invoice needs approval. Note that if an invoice approver records an invoice, it is automatically approved. You can also send a message to the company email you have associated with QuickBooks. You can add any other email address you wish to include. You can also customize the subject or the message of your email. If the invoice approver has the QuickBooks Online mobile app installed on their devices, they can receive a push notification anytime the invoice approval workflow triggers. Select the user from the drop-down. When you create a workflow, you set the conditions that trigger for it to start. The condition could be a specific amount, for a specific customer, or any other option in the When drop-down. For this video, let's choose Invoice Amount as the condition. Next, enter what conditions you want to trigger the need for approval. In this case, greater than or equal to $500 you can set up multiple conditions. To delete a condition, select the bin icon. If everything looks all right, select Save and Enable. QuickBook lists your new invoice approval workflow with any other workflows you may have set up under the My Workflows tab. From the Actions column, you can edit, disable, or delete a workflow. Now let's take a look at the approval process. Your team members can still fill out and save invoices. But if they record an invoice that meets the conditions you entered in the invoice approval workflow, they need to submit it for approval. Approving an invoice is easy. Just select Tasks, and the approver will see all the invoices that need approval, along with any other tasks they've set up. They can also look at the invoice and approve it from there. Remember, though, approving the invoice doesn't send it. It just approves it to be sent. The invoice will still need to be emailed or printed to the customer separately. Now you're ready to set up your own invoice approval workflows.